So today we got to get this here broken pickup over to our shop. So we're going to hook it up to the tow marrow and drag it over there. That's a real nice tie there. Yep, that's not going anywhere. Nowhere. You ready, Roscoe? Is there a right answer to this? Nope. Probably not. We'll go kind of slow. Doesn't do anything. Neutral? transmission out of this truck. Cool. We're hopefully going to get it torn down and see, you know, if the cam and stuff is undamaged. Good. And if it is all good and proper, then that engine we're building will receive that cam and it's going to have a nice little choppy chop to it. Send it. We'll send it. Well, this is not going to work. Yeah, we got this. Baby, you just tie that around your waist. Tie it around my waist? Yeah. Yeah, oh yeah. 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 All right. I hope it cranks up and runs and right. pulls you. Ready? Yeah. Go, honey, go! <laughs> All right, now I might need to help myself. It might say otherwise, this video footage. Uh, it's all about perspective. Who edits these videos? <laughs> <laughs> oh, sweet kitties. You can always find kitties around here. They're lighting things on fire over there. of Tanner's motor that we found in his exhaust. If you have any of that, you're gonna have a bad time. Guys, I just wanna 
gonna show you really quick why you pick your garden every day. This is why. That is an okra beside my face. They are no good this size. Oh look, that was a small one. Look at this one. That's huge. Huge. Okay, YouTube, here's what we've got going here. We cannot get this torque converter off the normal way because ordinarily you'd have to rotate each of the three bolts that holds it on to here, take it off, but she's locked up solid. So we're gonna have to get a little bit creative try and get them off like this. Maybe we can reach all three. But we can't get it on the engine stand until we get this torque converter off. We got it. this on the camera. That's a little bit okay. of a snafu if you will. So this here is your harness that goes to your knock sensors and as you can see it is flat as all get out. It got smashed in one of these intake ports and that could explain why our scanner wasn't showing knock when Tanner's engine blew up. Could have been user error. Nah, I'm gonna blame it on the tuner. They always do. <laughs> Pull this head off and see what looks bad. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. <laughs> hey, Lyle. Yeah. Yeah. Camera. Check out the head. It's it so bad. Look, it should not look like that. Look at that. That's all chewed up. Terrible. Come on, do piston stuff. <laughs> oh, wait. Once upon a time, there oh. were two nice flat top pistons in these holes. Yeah, that thing's all... They are gone. That thing's all mashed up. <laughs> you look like you're preg checking a cow. Yep. That's your crankshaft bearing right there. Yeah, that's the uh, rod bearing. Yeah. And, and that's, that's, a, that's, that's, that's just a big old chunk of a piston. That's awesome. Why are these yeah. up here in the lifter? <clears throat> it's like a nugget. It's, it's a aluminum supplement. <laughs> There's some more nuggets to your four piece nugget meal. Oh! Yeah. Oh! Well, what do you know about that? Proud owner of the right tool. This is glorious. For once in our lives, we don't have to jerry-rig something. 
Let's see how easily this works with the right stuff. Got him! Ha! Okay. Yeah, it's, it's marred. Oh, yeah, she is messed up. You cannot use that junk. Sometimes it's really good, sometimes it's shit. It's pretty sort of way. The style, though. Yeah, full sandwich. Look at this. Look at all this junk. That's, that's the whole engine that's down here. Well, three cylinders, anyways. We're gonna sweep your motor up off the floor. <clears throat> right. All right, old Lyle here is gonna bondo. give us a tutorial on how to bondo stuff. You gotta have your bondo and your hardener. All right, pour some of your bondo out, take your hardener, give her a little squeezy, squeezy, squeeze like that right there. Chop, 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 chop. Mix it in real good. Flip it all around until it's all one color. All the solid color. Hard and deep. See that nice pink right there? Oh, that's a great looking that's pink. That's what we're looking for. Okay. Now, we got all one color here almost. Now, quickly before it hardens, we're going to scoop some up. Come on over here. You're going to see this. Up. Scoop it. You're going to get another one. Okay. We're going to scoop it up. See this? We're going to slap it down. Just like that. Just slather it Just like that. Just slather it like that. See, we're covering all them creases. See that Just, big hole right there? Yeah. Gone. Gone. Just get it. So the appropriate method is to just put as much as possible on there. Yes, and then you want to smooth it out a little bit. Less work the next time. See? Get some in there. Yeah. Yeah. Smoothing it out here just a minute. It's going to harden right up. We're going to use a cheese grater on it. Wow, it looks great already. Yeah, see, we're covering them holes. <clears throat> Smooth them body lines out. Oh, hold on, hold on. Oh, no, don't look at that. Don't look at that. No, cover it. No, okay. Yeah. All right, yep, yeah, right here. There See, you go. It's this. like that hole never existed. Ooh. Exactly. We'll go over another time if we have to. See? That's just first coat, all right? <clears throat> it's just the first draft. Yeah, don't, just the first Don't judge draft. it too quickly, right? Yep. Yeah. Smooth it out. Less work. Yeah. Yeah. All right. See, See this one right here? Oh, yeah. yeah. You got yeah. one right there? Yeah. yeah. You going to fill it in? Look at that. You never knew that was there. Hurry. We gotta get I never knew. You, you got to get some more. Yeah. Don't waste it. I can't let the Bondo go. Oh, get, right, get, get, get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Coming in. There we go. You didn't even see that one going there, did you? Wow. Yeah. <clears throat> so this is like, this is the way like West Coast Customs does it, huh? This is like Count's Customs right here. Oh. This is a real professional job. Yeah. I'll feel the heat coming off that. Mm. Chemical reactions. I feel the heat. Mm-hmm. You'll feel it when I beat you in your Tesla. What? Called out. Made Done called me out. Tesla. Man. All right. Let's size this thing up. You we got. Front there. Yeah, you oh yeah, you got an intercooler on there. Wow. How many ponies this thing make? Pop the hood. All right. We're going to pop the hood. You picture that boost gauge right there. Maxing that thing out. Oh, it's got a boost gauge for sure. Let's see what's under here. Uh, got it. We got an Ecotec with a turbo. Oh my goodness. How big is that thing? It's got to be at least 40 millimeters. 38. <laughs> <laughs> wow. But, I mean, you got a lot working in your favor because I got weight reduction. What, you got weight Bondo. reduction. You Bondo's took like the whole no back of the car yeah. is gone now. Yeah, it's right here, see? Right so here. You, you ain't got all that weighing you down. Yeah, see, it's Peterbilt. That adds like at least 50 horsepower. Yeah, has this thing got like a diesel in it? No, it's just got. So a, like a semi? It's got an Ecotech turbo covering up the cat engine in it, okay? Uh huh. Man, I bet this thing rips. Roll some coal. Wow. There you go, cut. Well, thanks for the lesson in bodywork. You bet.
Well, that's all folks. We got one messed up motor. The cam was not salvageable. Thanks for watching.